problem was was that um I yeah there you go yeah okay, yeah, we're, yeah. Good, we're good so we're the problem good. uh well the thing was was that I did a new login today mm -hmm. and uh, because of my new login uh, it changed my stream key so ah it didn't like that yeah so it didn't like that so I just had to, I just had to update the stream key all right cool 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 um but yeah man I haven't I haven't done any sort of well I mean I guess I do walk for like an hour a day but that doesn't really count really you know mm -hmm. what I mean so it's like I haven't done anything like that for like fucking two, three weeks now at this point, and I'm not gonna lie, I feel way less stressed. <laughs> <laughs> like I don't know, like um, uh, I'm I'm still really upset that uh uh uh, fuck, Ring Fit isn't available still. Like it's still not around. Yeah. Uh, because like. Gonna... I think I need that little bit of gamification in order to like really get into like, you know, get into a routine. Cause as of right now, when I was doing the stuff, like even, you know, it wasn't even that intense, but when I was doing the stuff, I was just like, dude, I don't want to fucking do this. Yeah. And it was it's just hard, torment, you know? Uh, all right. Starting is always like the hardest. I mean, it's not like for me, it's not even starting, it's continuing. Is, oh. the, is the yeah about to say like it's the exact opposite well not the exact opposite but it's different for, uh, for me because like I'll be struck with inspiration and I'll just do my workout you know what I mean um, I told you before that I need to like warm up to it sometimes but I'll just do it for a bit but after like I don't know like I did it for a solid like two months like previously mm -hmm. like this during this last little bout of working out <clears throat> excuse me um, and I was like and I was like ah. Eh. And then I was just like, I don't know. I was just stressed. I was tired. And it was just like, it was the idea of like, my entire day was mentally prepping myself to do my workout and mm. then doing it, suffering, and then having to go do other shit. <laughs> I don't know. That's interesting. I really, I really want Ring Fit. <laughs> <laughs> I, wonder if Ter cool. I wonder if Terrence is still using it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, he can blend it to you. Especially now that he lives a lot closer, but I mean, cause like the, cause like the thing is, is that um, like, cause, cause you know how I, you know how I have like weird mental stuff sometimes. Like mm -hmm. if I have ring fit or something like that, that is not working out. That is me playing a game. You know what I right. mean? Like it gives me something to work work towards because like because like that's a that's a thing that discourages people all the time right is that they'll work out and then they won't see immediate results so it's that little bit that keeps you going of like hey you got this many coins or whatever exactly because that that that, vic that vicariously becomes the instant gratification they did a lot better with ring fit than they did with we fit correct <laughs> <laughs> You mean that it actually promotes fitness and not just yes. kind of balancing? And kind of like yoga. <laughs> yoga, yoga can be pretty intense. I tried to do a, a, oh, yeah. like a few yoga routines, and it can get pretty intense, but it's definitely not like the same. It's not what I'm looking for. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Excuse me. I, wonder where all, I, I know Saba said she'd be late, but I was, I'm wondering where everyone else is. You want to message Adrian? I'll message Carrie. Sure. Uh... I'm super not looking forward to Tuesday. Why? Oh, yeah, you have five glasses. Yeah. Yeesh. I just, like, I don't know. I don't want to do texturing. <laughs> That's I'm, what I'm not looking forward to. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm assuming that he's probably got like you have Casnamera, right? Is that how you say his name? <laughs> yes, it's Casnamera. <laughs> okay. Um, you could just call him Kaz, Mr. Kaz. Okay. Um, I'm assuming he's gotten better because I'll remind I, you that oh. I was in his first class, the very first class that he ever taught, and he was fucking awful. He yeah. was he was one of those he was one of those guys that would like you'd ask a question. And then he would just do it for you and not explain how he did it. And I'm like, I appreciate that you did my work for me, but I need to learn how to do this. So that way I can do your later assignments. I need you know? some hands-on. Yeah. I need a little bit of hands-on here. Um, and 
and hopefully he fucking realizes that engineers are not artists because <laughs> that was a problem hey adrian hello hello adrian i was vibing to some new songs and i was also very sleepy to get to the computer what were you listening to uh just whatever my spotify like discover weekly gives me oh nice fair it was like some rock song that was pretty cool. I should check out the Discover Weekly more. I'm looking to like, looking for new stuff. Yeah, it's pretty much the only way I discover mu new music now beside that and my YouTube recommendations, basically. Yeah, pretty much, same here. It's like, I wanna, ha I wanna know more good music, but like, I'm very bad at looking for it myself. <laughs> I think I I don't want to get up and look just in case, but I think I think my milk went bad. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Who knows? Maybe I'm becoming lactose intolerant since I haven't been drinking nearly uh, as much milk. Maybe. It does make me fart quite a lot. Lactose intolerant. You're developing allergies. <laughs> California has done wonders for me. <laughs> I can you hit lost hey. so much money. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, cool, cool news though, because like I don't know if you remember from a while ago, but I would tell you that um, drinking water would give me acid reflux. Yeah. It doesn't anymore. Hey, nice. Uh, so I, I can did. drink. I can drink water like uh, a normal water. human. Water. <laughs> Just crushed a roach that was on my desk. Ew. It was a little baby tiny roach that wandered in the wrong place at the wrong time, that being right under my tissue-covered fist. <laughs> the fool. <laughs> the fool. Why, why is your room always so full of bugs? Um, because... I don't know. Because I, I invite them in. Because <laughs> people in my house uh, are very food hygienic. Mm. Um, the... I have a roommate, uh, and he's like uh, about my age, a little bit older, uh, and uh, he is like so high unhygienic that he doesn't use the bathroom every day, but when he does, consistently, like it's very messy. As oh in, no! Like, as in, well, not as in, like, there's stuff thrown about, but as in, like, I can see the residual dirt just from his usage of the bathroom that's been strewn across the surfaces of the, like, there'll be stains on the bathtub, like, they, it'll be relatively clean when, before it goes in, it'll, it'll come out, and there'll be, like, dark stain on the bottom of the bathtub. Uh, <laughs> so he, he, so he's the fucking mud spirit from, uh, Spirited Away? Kind of. <laughs> uh, he consistently... Uh, not every time, but like, like pretty consistent, like maybe like, maybe like four or five out of ten times, like, he'll use the bathroom and he will not only not flush, but he'll leave the toilet seat up. Oof. Uh, it hasn't happened with number two yet, but it, like, a lot of times I'll just like, hit the, the scent of his urine will just be wafting the bathroom when I go and check it. Oh, disgusting. no. Not uh, to not to Shanghai the story a little bit, but uh, I've told many stories about the. Actually, wait, no, Adrian, you were living with us at the time. Do you remember Nate? Yeah. He would constantly do that because he was, you know, he'd be he'd be raiding in WoW or whatever, right? And uh, that was his excuse for why he never flushed the toilet. And uh, there'd be times where I'd come back from like you know school or whatever after school thing I was doing. And uh, he would have used the bathroom two or three times in a single uh, evening without flushing it. Uh, number Not one and number one and number two. And when I and when I called him out on it, being like, "Yo, it takes half a second to flush," he would get all uppity with me, saying like he doesn't have that kind of time to waste. What? I I will say that like. I wouldn't be nearly as mad if he at least put the fucking toilet seat cover down. 
because then it doesn't fester in the entire bathroom and only stays in the toilet. I mean, you should still be mad. That's still gross. If I mean, I get it. I get like there's you know conservational politics between flushing whenever you pee, and that's whatever. That's I can accept that. I personally flush every time because I prefer that. But like, if you're gonna not flush, at least put the toilet seat down, right? I the least yes. you could do. The least you could do is that. Although, can we uh, can we like pivot just a wee bit? Because like I want to talk about that. What what is like the water conservation idea like stuff? Like I don't get that. What because like the water can't go anywhere, right? Um. Because like because like it's not like I don't know. It's not like energy. Right, it's not like electricity where you have to convert one thing into another thing, and then that secondary thing is more or less consumed. You know what I mean? Like I mean, water, I, I... like when you flush the toilet, it does have to get processed and stuff like that, but it goes back into the water supply. Right. I well, mean, if you I... have a gray water system. No, no, no. I'm saying like even on a global scale. Like, if oh, you, you okay. can't, like, even if you fucking vaporize water, it still goes into the atmosphere and eventually precipitates back down. Okay. I, you, I see what you're saying. You you're, know, you're saying, like, global scale. Uh, like, global, scale. like, global scale and even, I guess, like, a little bit more regional? And I don't know. Maybe this is still me. Because I, I talked about it all the time, right? Like, the Merrimack River in Massachusetts. Mm -hmm. Where, excuse me, where it's just, like, I don't know. Like, I guess my perspective on this thing is just like, how do you run out of water? <laughs> like, I don't know. I mean, I guess like the idea. How do deserts even exist, bro? And keep That's in mind this point, from actually. keep in mind this from someone who failed both biology and chemistry. Um, <laughs> but so grain of salt. But I mean, my assumption is that like I don't know. It theoretically would. Like, if you use less water daily by contaminating it with the whatever that you wash down with it, like, you need to sp then, then you can spend less energy filtering it back up again so it's usable. I don't know. That's a good point. So maybe it's not directly about... Maybe it's not directly about the water, but what we do to the water that makes it expensive. Yeah, just the process of having to filter it more, can, more frequently than, like, I guess theoretically that spends more energy or something but i mean i also figure that part of it is on just the personal level of like if you use more water you pay more for your water bill or whatever yeah i guess i don't know i mean like like I, obviously i'm not gonna repeat myself but it's like you 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 get me right where i feel like it's a little off and i would really 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 appreciate somebody who could explain it to me right I mean, I get, I get it on like the level of like, I don't think water is destroyed, much like matter is destroyed. But like, I don't know, I could see reasons why that aren't necessarily related to those. Like, those are valid points. But like, there are other valid points the other way. Like, 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 cause I, I, like, cause I mean, like, obviously, don't leave your sink running while you're not using it, right? Like that one, like that, like that sort of thing. Obviously, just don't do that. But when it comes to like. When it, when it gets so extreme that you're not flushing after you pee, that seems a little extreme to me. I don't know. Speaking I mean, of... Oh, yeah. Go ahead. I was just going to say, like, that goes back to my point of, like, I don't know, theoretically saving the energy they would use to filter that water, which, by the way, uh, I mean, just to mention this real quick, uh, like, individuals are not the problem. We spend very little energy compared to... Never mind. But... Um, <laughs> this is true. Anyway. Uh, but the idea is that, like, you spend less energy flushing all of it down if you wait for, like, a few donations rather than just, like, every single one, I guess, theoretically. Which is an argument, and I'm not... I think that's fine. I don't have too much umbrage with that as long as you're, you know at least polite enough to close to like put the seat down when you're done with it so it doesn't stink up the entire place so grant you had something that you wanted to say real quick yeah i was just gonna say speaking of water and shit i'm, I'm just watching this uh the gameplay of man eater and this game looks awesome <laughs> bruh i am absolutely playing that on stream 
Like, like, uh, like, um, earlier today we were trying to set up for, like, a playtest so I could get some footage of God Save the Queen, and, uh, and, and, uh, Ed didn't show up for, like, an hour, so I was just sitting there with AJ just kind of chit-chatting, and I was like, you know what, what if I make a collection on Steam and just, like, all the games that I either haven't played in a while or haven't finished or whatever, I'll just snatch them up and I'll either play them solo or I'll play them with somebody or whatever, right? And just going through all this stuff, and then I started talking about Man Eater. Um, Adrian, I know you're not necessarily super into this sort of thing, but have you heard of this game, Man Eater, at all? Uh, when you first said it, I thought it was, was that one indie game where you play as the horror monster that's like blood and has tendrils and whatnot, and I looked it up and it's that's, not. That's, not sure, ca I... that's Carrion, and that's a fucking awesome game. I'm, right. super, well... I'm super looking forward to when Carrion comes out, but no. So, Man Eater, you play as a shark, and it is a fully fledged, full story RPG with Dark Souls esque combat. <laughs> it's pretty uh, fucking cool. It's the I coolest mean... shit I've seen. Now, Grant, uh, who who are you? Who are you watching play Man Eater? No, oh, no, I'm just watching a compilation of like boss fights. Oh, don't... S well, I guess you're probably never gonna buy it, but it's just like, oh. probably not gonna buy it. Ugh. I mean, I only got to, like, the fourth boss fight. Ugh. It looks too graphic-intensive for me. Uh, also, the, game, uh, the game is quite high fidelity, and uh, it's also unbelievably violent. <laughs> yes. Carrie and Saba both said we could start, by the way. Okay, I guess. They're gonna be late. Don't forget Discord. <sighs> looks like it's looks like it's boys night. <laughs> boys boy, night. Hey, boy night. So who's gonna take Maya? Hang with the boys. We're gonna so we're gonna have to figure out who's taking right, everybody play, else's part. Play my sister. You do it. Uh, I, did I read this already? Uh, I don't Maybe. just read it again. Yeah, no, that's what I call being a man. <laughs> this is me fucking slamming through the door. Oh, I, I was able to get it. Man. Oh my oh. god! Dr. Gray! Commune with him quickly, he's still... <laughs> his spirit's click. still here. Also, who writes click like that? Click. I think it was with Maya. What the fuck? Oh. oh. This is a nightmare, and also, please stop showing me uh, Maya's cleavage. It's really weird. <laughs> Uh, who's taking Maya? So, so, so this is or, well, um, so Maya channeling. The I was about to say this would be Maya channeling the 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 other lady, I guess. But who wants Maya? I'll pull this real quick. I was murdered. Uh, Maya? That man murdered me, so I killed him. What? Oh, it's a click because she's taking Ooh. pictures. It's Lada. Fuck off, Lada. I'm gonna snap your neck. You can't. Oh, you can't. shit. Saba is correct again. What? God damn it. I forgot to take the overlay off. I'm trying a, I'm trying a new, I'm trying a new setup, so I wasn't used to looking at it. You're an absolute fool. Oh, I mean, I read that many cards, but I didn't have to snap your neck twice before you could reach mine. <laughs> oh, Time God. this, I've ever stopped up shots. Snapping. But anyway, what's going on here? This gal, is she Maya? I don't know who this, this is. is. This is Step you, Step away from... Oh, I think this is the, the aunt. Oh, you're oh. probably right. Yeah. Step away from there. Oh, God, Please this Goomba. leave this area to me. Go quickly and inform the police. But, but... Hurry before there are more victims here. What are you talking about? What's that happening? Promise. Hey, this let's go, scary. city boy. Leave this to the granny. I haven't consumed enough energy yet. <laughs> this you gotta help me find things to eat out here. Could I in village? Could I in village? Could I in? A cell phone doesn't get reception out here. So I ended up using the phone booth to call the police. Bro, this is kind of spooky. I'm glad that we didn't fucking and... uh, do this last night or two nights ago. <laughs> They're on their way. 
That's good. Oh, the yes, uh, Jenny Wan mysterious phenomenon. <laughs> Loudy. <laughs> I Loud. saw genuine mysterious phenomenon. <laughs> she seems really on edge because of all this. Not that I blame her. I'm scared to death by what's going on. I don't know. I'm a little weirded out. This is fucked. What the hell is happening? She's clearly hey, channeling Mr. something. That gal, Maya, she wasn't the one that pulled the trigger, was she? I don't know, probably. <laughs> she is fucking <laughs> covered in blood. Where'd she even get the gun? Man, you right. <laughs> <laughs> it's a spirit gun. <laughs> oh, spirit gun, that's her special move. It's cannon? Lotta doesn't, Lotta doesn't know that when Maya's channeling, her whole physical appearance changes. Yeah, this is canon. So people see Mia. So people... Yeah. S what the... F how... How does this work? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I mean, the judge doesn't have that great eyesight. No, That's but I'm true. saying, like, on a real scale, how the fuck does this work? <laughs> it, it's literally magic, Zach. Yeah, magic. but what about the other? What about the other mystics? Magic. It's literally magic. Then again, weren't there only two of them in there? I reckon she must have done it then. Oh, it's literally a locked room murder. Ah, uh, that's funny. <laughs> Lot of. What do you know about Doctor Gray? Not much, but I did some digging so I could put the body in there for later. <laughs> you know when dogs dig up bones? That's like me. That's what I do when when winter comes. That's one gent with a bad reputation. With bodies. Really? I hear he's good at surgery and stuff, but his personality stinks like wet sheep. I keep trying to bury seeds for the winter, but they keep growing into trees. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> and then I have to eat the trees. I have to, I eat, have the trees. to eat the trees. I mean, sure. honestly, it's kind of effective. I feel like they could base a whole, like, technique of civilization on this stuff. <laughs> I think I'm the first one to figure this out. Probably. <laughs> I mean, I figured this out somewhat, like, 4,000 years ago. <laughs> uh, agriculture, I think, was first created 9,000 years ago, so I don't know if you want to change your story a little bit. What are you, some sort of history buff? <laughs> you some sort of Democrat? Are you some sort of Democrat? Just some sort of Democrat? What does that mean, Grant? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I am a devout I am a devout Christian of God because I was there when he created the earth. No oh my God. Adrian, no. <laughs> Adrian, I refuse this lore. I veto okay. this. You vetoed my flea Illuminati. I'm vetoing I'm vetoing Lada being anything other than just a vegan. Fair enough. <laughs> I just forgot that impression myself. He's real controlling. As soon as his nurse or patient don't do what he says, he starts a hollering. Must have been real rough to work for him. I believe it. Alright, have go back you in? seen <laughs> my badge? Hey, they'll be here soon, right? The Kermits, I mean. I reckon you should be getting back to the crime scene now so you can incriminate yourself. <laughs> <laughs> tamper, with the, tamper with the crime scene like you usually do? <laughs> no! No, no, Adrian. Illegally she, pick up someone's she, phone, probably. She she gets better and better at like being a shitty witness. So like she's like, yeah, yeah, head on in there, and while you're at it, hold this bloody knife. And as soon as you like walk through the door, she takes a picture and she's like, he's the murderer. <laughs> he did it. Take this bloody knife I've been carrying my pocket for the last six weeks. It keeps her up in the blood. I think it's cursed. <laughs> I think it's cursed. <laughs> God damn it. All right. Let's talk to this Goomba. Ah, uh, Mr. Right. Oh god, I forgot about the slurping. It's so <laughs> bad. Miss Faye, um, how's, uh, Mystic Maya? She has returned to this world. The spirit severing technique was successful. So did you fucking drug her or something? Because that doesn't... Uh Absolutely. Man, the, this the spirit is... severing technique is just a really strong karate chop. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I do want to say real quick before we proceed, because it's just like like my brain is obviously worrying, trying to think of like, oh, who could have done it? Like, what happened? 
and I keep thinking about how this is all fake or whatever, right? But her physical form changed, meaning that yeah. she did do the channeling. It's so weird because this is actually magic. <laughs> and it's like, what and it's like, well, and it's like, I don't fucking know. Just throw all logic out the window. Fucking Let me see her, it. please. She's still unconscious. I humbly <laughs> request that you wait outside for her recovery. I chopped her in the base of the neck very hard. <laughs> I what snapped are, her neck. What are you, Doctor Stone? Uh, Hello. Hello, oh, Saba. Hi, Saba. Who's this? Hello, Saba. Saba. I'm glad, Zach, that even when I'm, I literally can't be in this chat, that <laughs> I still have to help you with technical problems. Listen, I w I'm working with a new setup, man. <laughs> and also, Saba, I'm assuming you've been following along, but you just murdered someone. Yeah, I mean, I couldn't follow along, but I know, I know, I know I seem incredibly guilty, and maybe even guilty, but... <laughs> Executor. <laughs> guilty and maybe even guilty. Boys are here. Sorry to keep you waiting. And backups arrive too. Gum By the way, is Carrie not making it this time? She okay. says she's gonna be late. Okay. Oh, <laughs> there go all my viewers. By the way, <laughs> I had I had fucking seven viewers for a hot second there, and now we're down to two. Wow. <laughs> um. Okay. Oh, you're dead. Yeah, it's me. Here, I'll go back. I can add one to you. <laughs> it doesn't matter. If it's not over three, it doesn't matter. <laughs> what are you doing all the way out here, Detective Gumshoe? You called me. Oh, yeah. It's actually kind of funny. I was in the area for a business trip, pal. Oh, which, by the way, so obviously uh, yesterday with uh, the game night was the highest, like, consistent amount of uh, viewers I had on the channel so far. But... You can check your stats on like a video by video, like week by week, month by month, or lifetime on the channel basis. And despite the fact that we had a consistent 10 viewers on stream last night, uh, my overall average for my channel, which is like the thing that actually matters, only raised by 0.1%. <laughs> well, that's and, what 10 is, right? It's 0.1%. Yeah, that's well, true. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. <laughs> But, uh, but yeah, <laughs> so, so I, so like, I think in order to get to the affiliate rank, I need to like suddenly have like 300 viewers watch me for like two hours and then I'll hit it. <laughs> and it's like, oof. Anyway. Good Lord. Well, time to check out the crime scene. I'll have to question everyone here later on. So just sit tight, all right? This is really interesting. This is the first time that we've been like in... The investigation. Why is he grinning at me? Shall I show you to the scene of the crime? <laughs> Detective Gumshoe. Jim Shoe. Jim Shoe. Have we met her yet, by the way? We have. Yeah. Oh, did Zach do it? Uh, wait, who? Oh, no, not yet. Not yet. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> I have oh, no I idea thought... who you're talking about. It's okay, continue. I oh, thought you were talking was... about, uh, I thought you were talking about this Goomba lady here. Goomba. The two of them went into the channeling chamber. I guess all I can do for now is see what everyone else has to say. Uh, channeling chamber? Can I go in? Oh, I can! Oh, okay. <laughs> Maya, what the fuck? <laughs> Why'd you murder? It's, it's, it's not my fault. It might be, but it might not. The police are busy running around here and there, and I don't see Maya anywhere. You just- oh. Ah! Ah! The fire! Ah! <laughs> oh, I gotta put a Kermit on. Every time. Hey, you don't touch anything. But it's bright, look, and I like it. Look, I like really monk. need to ask you some questions. Uh, don't look at me like I'm sort of a caring jerk. Tell you what, pal. Oh, why don't you ask me a few questions, alright? Wow, he is so easy to guilt trip. <laughs> what? I can't. Oh wait, am I am I literally just not allowed to address? Raymond three thousand six hundred ninety two is dead. Talk to him, I guess. But I want to. Yeah, but not again. I want to investigate the blood stain, please. Get some felt in the back of the trunk and bring it back to life. All right, fine. Um, about Maya. I hate to break this to you, pal, but uh, with the way things look now, that girl's the only one who could have done it. Well, 
All right, let's talk about this real quick. Let's let's talk about some actual in-universe like Phoenix Wright lore. So clearly, Maya becomes a different person when she channels. Does that still mean that she is responsible for the actions of that other individual? Probably. I would say yes to a certain degree because you're the one who's bringing them back, so you're. Like, you are the guarantee, like, you're responsible for that person. Then, and also, then, like, it, this it, is a universe where the only time a medium has been used in legal course got that medium basically shamed out of society, so law doesn't have a very good view on them. That is, that is true. Well, okay, so then, so then one, so then one more question, then we'll proceed. But, so, if this is a possibility that a mystic could channel someone and then they could cause harm or whatever to an individual... How do they not have it in some sort of contract where they're like, yeah, we're not responsible for if you bring your murder victim back to life and then they murder you? You know what I mean? Like that feels Maybe they really just weird. weren't smart enough or they weren't thinking in that way. Well, has any other spirit acted this way? Why would they have reason to think so? That's a good point. That's a really good point. Because, I mean, like, they've been doing this for, like, what, hundreds of years? You know what I mean? So I would assume... Yeah, they've been doing like this that. for what? Like... A three years? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. But yeah, I don't know. I'm just thinking about it. Because, like, once again, this is a universe with magic in it, I guess. Oh, yeah. It's magical. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Only Maya and the victim were inside this room after all. But Maya is... You can ask more about her later, pal. Right now, I've got a job to do. And that's putting that Kermit out on fire. <laughs> it burns Gumshoe, it's so hard. <laughs> just, just stand still. Detective Gumshoe looks This really one big out. stomp, just like. So, what we're saying is, each Kermit is also like that moth meme with a lamp. Except this time it's a candle. That's one of the weaknesses. Like they, like, they, they like fire, but they also burn really easy because they're made of felt. <laughs> yes. It, it's, it's very. They're one of their crucial weaknesses. <laughs> you just see a Kermit like stare, like his face is down, eyes bulging, just staring at the flame on a candle, and he's like, "Look how it dances." Goes <laughs> <laughs> off in the deepens, distance, and he suddenly becomes poetic. <laughs> off in the distance, like like I I figured it out. The weakness is fire. <laughs> <laughs> I can do it. That that same Kermit from before, he's just staring at the fire. He's like, Watch it dance, the fleeting of the light. It is beautiful, is it not? And he pushes. Just like it. I need to become part of that beauty. And then... we, we must all become part of its beauty. Pushes the candle over, starts setting the building on fire. Wow. I don't know where that voice came from, by the way. <laughs> that's uh, that's Kermit crossed with like a druid or something. <laughs> As best as Kermit. <laughs> so. Dr. Gray was shot with a gun, huh? He was shot in the forehead. Yeah. Man, execution style. Oh. But. But? But he was also stabbed in the chest with a knife. Alright, fine. And then he was shot again. <laughs> and then fine. he was shot with a knife. <laughs> and then he, was and then he got his limbs ripped off. Little did you know that gun was actually a knife in disguise while that gun was. <laughs> well, the knife was actually a gun. It was actually a box, disemboweled, <laughs> set on fire, frozen in parts, then shattered, burnt by acid. Yeah, this is There's a magical the world after all. <laughs> the big was first stab, then he was shot. Oh my god. Um, not, not to bring it up again, but <laughs> fucking, I know the Game Grumps didn't actually make the joke, and I'll have to find the original video, but it's the fucking, uh, like, Saul, uh, Saul Reitman or whatever joke of, like, and then they, they pushed me down the stairs and bonked me on the head, set me on fire and burned me alive, <laughs> and then and then they stole my Microsoft Dinosaur CD. Oh my god! <laughs> just There's like a... it's just like an escalation of violence, <laughs> and then just immediate de-escalation to something that shouldn't fucking matter. <laughs> and I love there's it. A, there's a really good Who's Line clip that I love, where it's like, uh, it's this. They're setting up the scene, and they, they, there's a, it's like a noir detective, and the guy's like, "I finally came back after 30 years to the guy who thought he'd killed me, but it turns out that when you push a man down some stairs, hit him in the head, roll up the carpet, set it on fire, and throw it off the ocean, you better make sure he's dead." 
That's really good. Oh. How do you know he was stabbed first, Gumshoe? Are you some sort of psychic? Wait, did he I say first? It... I think he just said he was also stabbed. No, no he, he said, said he was stabbed yeah. first he, he and then shot. He said he was shot. stabbed oh. first and then shot, yeah. Have you seen my badge? Ah, oh, I'm really busy right now. I can't take a look at it. Later, all right, pal. You can take a glance at it. And also, you don't look that busy. You're just standing here, staring at me. He's staring at the blood on the floor. Not really? Let blood. me look at it. I don't want to go to this other place, because then I have to read a line, and I'm scared of who this is. <laughs> you can't move from that spot. You might knock a Kermit into the candle. <laughs> do it, do it. <laughs> I'm I'm not looking forward to this. I'm gonna be honest. Oh boy. I because I don't because like the fact that Saba is oh shit I went backwards. The fact that Saba is so excited really makes me nervous. All right, oh here you go. Hmm. Pretty sure there was someone sleeping here earlier. <laughs> oh. Uh, I don't I don't know who this is. So, like, how can I help you? What the, <laughs> the hell? You said you wanted more funny voices, Zach. Yeah, she's perfect. So, I'm not gonna lie. I'm really looking forward to this. But <laughs> you're gonna have to give me a second because I need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, gee. We so have I will, prep time, guys. I will, will be right back. Alright. Cue Zach finding, like, a, hiring someone on Fiverr to do it for him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go get some candy because we have some candy now in the house, and I have a sweet tooth. Nice. Da, da, da. Well, how are you, Grant? I am doing all right. How are you, Saba? Okay. Yeah, we went out today with like a group of like two other families, social distancing, but uh, we like walked a trail today. Oh, well, that's nice. Yeah, I'm just afraid now of, uh how many bug bites I'll have tomorrow morning. Oof, yeah. yeah. But it must have been nice to get out of the house, you know? Yeah, for sure. For sure. Mm. Are mosquitoes, like, super attracted? Because that's oh, how they God. are. With well, I mean, one time I went out of the country and we slept under, like, mosquito nets. Mm -hmm. Right? The morning after, because I slept in there with, like, my mom and my two sisters, right? Right. My mom and my two sisters, you know, it just had, like, maybe one or two bug bites on them. And then you looked at me. And my, like, my entire arms and my entire legs oh, were God. just all covered in bug bites. Like, just swollen up. <laughs> yeah, and... I was in the. I'm under the same net as my sisters and my mom. Why are like, we well, we, devoured? We could evenly drink blood from all of them, but or we yeah. could all just get Saba. Yeah, we just, she's, she's got the nicest blood, apparently. Yeah, you, flattery, I guess. <laughs> I don't need that kind of flattery. Man. <laughs> they can all die. I just feel it. Oh god. I don't know. If I don't know if I'm to that degree, but they certainly flutter to me rather than my family <laughs> oh yeah it wasn't one, that time, one time when i was walking home from middle school graduation uh i was or i was with my friends and we were like walking uh there was like an uncomfortable amount of us uh on the sidewalk so like i was the one that was like outlying i'm kind of like near the street side of the sidewalk mm -hmm. um and uh yeah we were walking back to one of our friends houses and I felt a really sharp pain in my chest. And I was like, ah, what the hell? And uh, everyone's like, you all right? And I was like, yeah, yeah, I think I'm fine. But I just really hurt all of a sudden. And they're like, all right, well, maybe whatever. And like 20 minutes later, it happens again. And I'm like, ow. And I'm like, what? They're like, what happened? Like, I rub my chest. And I'm like, it feels like, I don't know. It feels something hurt. It's like, all right. One of them was like, all right, well, usually when... Uh, like one was like my mom said that when you get chest pains you gotta put pressure on us like all right i'll tie my shirt uh against my like body and then like 
we get I get hurt a third time and I look at my shirt and I like pull my collar like to so I can look down and a fucking wasp flies out of my oh, shirt. And, oh, oh no. Oh I was hoping you weren't gonna say wasp. Oh I feel bad. It was for absolutely you. a wasp and I was like, oh cool. Alright. I trapped a wasp in there unintentionally at the advice of my friend, cool. Oh, oh my god. god. Yeah, I, I don't wasps. I don't think I've, the only time I've ever been stung by anything, and I don't know what it was, it made me feel bad, but I was getting into my car, and I don't know, it might have been behind me somehow, but I laid my back against the seat, and that's how it stung me, but oh, I'm no. like, it's inside the car, like, I felt really bad, because it wasn't like I was, like, in its territory or something. It in, was like, in a your field. turf. <laughs> yeah, so I was like, how did you even get in here? Lost, lost things hurt like a son of a bitch. I just don't like how they can do it multiple times and not that die. That too. <laughs> Why do honeybees die instantly? Why do they have to suffer? Apparently, uh, it's only when they sting humans, though, because our skin is so squishy that their since their stingers are barbed, it gets stuck in their in our skin, and then uh, oh, that makes they just me rip their bad. abdomens out. Ah. Just have tougher skin, forehead. <laughs> just, have cover skin. just get rid of just skin just keep bone you know bees be better just have bone only bone just skeleton everyone oh so adrian i actually played my first D D session ever oh cool how'd it go it i was it was okay i felt like i had no idea what i was doing and i felt that's useless common. that's that's also common but uh yeah but yeah uh, it was okay Cool. Do you do you remember what you were playing as? You mean my character? Yeah. Yeah, I'm a half elf druid. Cool. Was there any reason why, or were you just kind of was that chosen for you? No, I I made the character. I just liked it, I guess. I just think they're neat. Yeah, that's cool. I just think they're neat. Yeah, I mean what? the next the next person because I I made like a second char character. When I say make, I just like kind of formulated around because I liked the I was looking at the different races and I just like zoomed through it trying to find like the one that stood out to me most so my second character I, I made or she's supposed to be I can't remember how to pronounce this hold on give me one second can, if you describe it I can probably tell you how okay no 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 I remember now okay it's called a Kalistar Ah, yeah, they're from uh, yeah, they're from a weird book that's like about uh, like magitech setting, basically. Yeah, so I liked the uh, the idea of like the dreaming and Corey yeah. and all of that. So I made th her into my second character. Cool. I uh, I don't know if Zach's told you or if you've been around me long enough to know, but I have a specific taste when it comes to characters, <laughs> and that is uh. That the, the the taste is large, powerful woman. That's basically it. <laughs> nice. Interesting. So yeah, I'm very inclined to to playing as uh that kind of character. Well. Anyway, um. That said, I don't get to play as a player ever because I'm always DMing. Oof. Ah. Uh, well, I mean, I just think then you have a very creative mind because dang, so much like thought and planning goes into that that i don't think i'd be capable of doing that that's what everyone says and except someone has to eventually suck up to it and just like swallow the stone and that was that person's me i listen, okay well I in that instance i feel bad then maybe the other people should suck it up and <laughs> and do it more but listen, I've, been, I've been playing with the same group for like fucking like two and a half years and not once have they dm for me oh <laughs> Yeah. Um time to force one. <laughs> <laughs> Hold well, a gun yeah, to their just, heads. Just, just say we're drawing sticks, dude. Yeah. Make them responsible. Dude, like I wish. Um yeah. <laughs> I'm Sexualizing. Assuming, we're, <laughs> assuming you were starting at level one as in D and D. Uh-huh. I mean I don't really know what else. Do yeah, you? that's fair. Level one is the simplest, but also the deadliest. And then, uh, like people start at, like to start at higher levels because then it like you start with more stuff you can do, but it's also more complex. 
I mean, I legitimately have no idea what the heck I'm doing. So it's funny because the person I'm doing it with, he's just like, oh, yeah, this is super easy once you get into it. And I'm I just I'm looking at this character sheet. I'm like, yeah, I have no idea what you're talking about. This isn't easy. I couldn't try explaining it, but I assume you've already had someone try to explain it to you before, so I won't bore the stream or you with that again. <laughs> no, yeah, it's it's somewhat fine. It's just there's a lot of, you know, stuff that, like, you know, goes in beforehand and it's kind of concrete. But then there's also aspects of it that occur during game. So, yeah. like, for how easy he says it is, I'm I'm in my mind, I'm like, this is actually quite a lot to take in for beginners. That's fair. Uh, I will say that uh, just like, I guess, comparatively, count your blessings or whatever, because like every older edition of D&D &D and like side system has been like exponentially more complex than this edition is. Oh my gosh. I must, yeah, than, than fifth edition. Wow. But yeah, um, I'm assuming you're playing 5th edition, of course. Uh, yeah, I believe so. Right. Yeah, fifth edition has been made really relatively simple compared to others, uh, design wise and like player wise. But uh, older editions have been really, really hard to get into. And uh, yeah, they they're part of the reason why fifth edition is so popular nowadays, and part of the reason D and D is popular nowadays because fifth edition is really relatively accessible. Like, That's nice. if you're if you're familiar with like video games and varying like RPG systems, you'll probably be familiar with how D and D works, or at least it won't be too hard to adapt to. I mean, I know the combat because we had one was like turn based, so it, yeah, I see the similarities. Yeah, I I don't know if you want to think about it this way at all, but like uh, the you can equate. Uh, like the d20 that you roll for like your attacks or whatever or your, like at basically anything to percentages where every one of the 20 is worth 5%. So like you have a 5% chance of critically hitting anything and a 5% chance of critically failing anything etc cetera, etc. Cetera. It's, a, it's a way to think about it. I don't think really helps but I, but I do a lot. <laughs> I'm bored and think about D&D &D too much. Wow. Well I mean no yeah it's a different way of uh, thinking about it. Yeah. Um, but basically, uh, like broad tips I could give you, uh, as a druid, you should probably, uh, at low levels focus on healing people. And if you just do that, you're fine. <laughs> that's, that's all that the party would want you to do probably, or the party would want you to do generally. Oh, it was, it was super clear. I mean, I have that in mind, but it, it's hilarious the fact that I feel like I'm the most responsible out of the group so far, because at the beginning, we were each granted, like, a sum of money, and literally everyone spent the entirety of their money, and then at the end, I'm just like, why did you guys spend all your money? <laughs> why do I have to take care of the finances? And I was left, and I kept money, and I was just like, you guys are all idiots. <laughs> I've been in that disaster area before. Um... <laughs> One of the few times I was a player, oh yeah, but one of the few times I was a player, I was a playing. Uh... I'll also say that every time I find a group to be a player in, there's always some like fucking, there's there's always some catch. Uh, the catch has ranged from the DM hates me and my character for some reason and has it out for me to the DM is homophobic, so it varies. Um, the catch this time was that I fucking despise one of the other players. Um, but sure. basically, basically, uh, we were given, like, we started at higher levels, so we were all more powerful, we all had access to more, like, cool stuff or whatever, right? Uh, the DM mm -hmm. gave us a bunch of money to buy, like, magic stuff, and I was just like, you know what, I'm not gonna buy any magic stuff, I'm just gonna save my money in case someone else needs it, because my character is, like, a good, kind of, like, donate money to others kind of person in case they need it, and also, like, a fiscally responsible person. Um, so... The game started, we, everyone had like cool magic items and weapons and armor that would help you kill things. And then no one bought any adventuring gear, as in like rations or like climbing <laughs> kits or like tents Torches. or anything. And so I was just like, all right, guess I am buying that for everyone. <laughs> yeah, there was See, a that's, part that's where... how I feel a little bit, yeah. There was a part where like uh, one character got kidnapped and like got returned but lost all their equipment and uh, everyone else was like, well, I mean, I spent all my money on like my magic sword and I was like, you know what, I'll buy you a new set of gear. You're good. And uh, yeah. yeah, 
There is a there's a plus side to all that. Yeah, that's true. Now you have people that owe you. I mean, my character was very nice and was the kind of people that took debts, but like, you know, it's still good. Yeah. So the Zach stand-in, are you ready to uh, say the voice? Because Zach took a very long time and we were talking about him hiring someone. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> I, so you don't have to explain because I do want to admit some of my favorite things to do when watching VODs is make special note of the times where I left the stream and then listen to what fucking people just talk about. Because every single time, you people are nuts. And it's fun. <laughs> <laughs> we're nuts. <laughs> we mean, we're <laughs> um, But yeah, I guess... How I you guess feeling, I'm... bud? <laughs> yeah. What did you eat, sir? Are you winning, the the system. System. <laughs> Are you winning, son? Are you winning, son? Are you I'm just, I'm, I'm just saying. I am pretty hungry now. <laughs> That's it. Wow. All right, let's keep going. Ah! Uh, uh, I, uh, that, uh, I. That, that's Phoenix having the bad milk too. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> Um, like, so isn't it about time to start? Huh? Time to start what? You know, like, the channeling! This hurts. <laughs> and, the, and by the way, this is the same fucking thing as Titty Cat Girl from the first game. April May? Yes. Oh, yeah, I think yeah. That was her name. Because it's the huh? exact same voice as that, but I will definitely have fun with this. Ch channeling? Oh, 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 no, actually, the situation has kind of changed. Huh? Like, what do you mean? God, she's so stupid. <laughs> Please stay calm, but there's been a murder. Um, so, like, a murder is that thing where, like, one person kills another, right? Whoa. <laughs> wow. Yes, a person has killed another person. Oh, that's, uh, what are the words I'm looking for? It's like, it's like a total bummer. Uh-huh. <laughs> this is this the perfect embodiment of Zack. I can feel it. <laughs> he is... We talked about this. <laughs> no, what? I'm not insulting you, sir. <laughs> You literally just you're said very... this is the perfect embodiment of me. <laughs> yeah, you're very. You think things through. I am not and... vapid. She meant what? Phoenix. <laughs> she yeah, if that. anything, if anything, Zach has the opposite problem where he uses too many words. This is true. <laughs> yeah. After all that effort, that's what she had to say. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to like introduce myself. My name is Eeny Mini. Is that right? Eeny Mini. Eeny Oh, it's Eeny Mini. Okay. <laughs> Eeny Mini. God, I hate this. <laughs> um, at the college, I'm researching and studying parapsych. <laughs> You're studying parapsychology. Dude, when I when I first read this, when I first played, I thought it said parapsychology. I was just <laughs> about I was just about the to read it like Paris. that, but then I recognized psychology. Like, that's why I read it weird. <laughs> what are you... How are you studying parapsychology? <laughs> parapsychology? That's right! Yay! <laughs> um, I think people, like, usually call it occult studies or something. Like, supernatural phenomenon, ESP, and psychic powers, that sort of stuff. That's pretty out there. I'm Phoenix Wright, attorney at law. See, now on her screen, my thing goes from question marks to saying Phoenix. <laughs> from her point of view. <laughs> so you just had to reintroduce yourself because you never knew who you were this entire time. I'm Phoenix. Oh, Carrie's here. Hi, Carrie. So... Okay. Hello. Oh, hello, okay. Carrie. So, what brings you here today? Um, like, so, I was one- I was the one who told Dr. Gray about this place. 
he asked me to like he asked me like do you know of a good spirit medium hmm dr gray did say something about being introduced to this place because like talking to dead people and like multiple personalities are what multiple personalities Wait. <laughs> that has nothing to do with parapsychology are you fucking telling me I have to do like a thousand voices? <laughs> I don't. I don't think that's the case. Are you? Am I getting? Am I getting my just desserts? Where I'm like, I want to do more voices, and now she's gonna have like fucking six uh, personalities. A finger on the monkey's paw curls. <laughs> no! <laughs> All right, this should be fine. I see. Then why are you taking a nap here? Like, I wasn't feeling good. Oh my, that's pretty cute, actually. <laughs> huh? I'm, like, allergic to sesame seeds. They, like, must have put some in the food they served for lunch. I'm, like, what did they serve for lunch? Sesame seeds? <laughs> <laughs> Assorted seeds, obviously. Man, that's a big it's, sesame bagel right there. No, it was it was wax soup with sesame seeds, obviously. Oh, that's right. Wax. <laughs> wax. Is is like traditional wax that's like made from like tallow and like you know animal fat? Is that edible? I don't think. I don't so. think I've ever wanted to think about something less than. <laughs> I wanted to think about eating is, pig is, fat. Is, is, is almost anything that comes from an animal edible? Is anything edible? Well, Do, I well, mean, we can't, like, we, can't chew, we can't we can't eat bones. You well, what if you turn? You into, can like, eat a what's powder? inside of bones. No, no, no. Okay, well, I, even then, powder, I don't know. You digest it. I, I don't know by that point if the co a prop bone are digestible or not. Hmm, if okay. it's just calcium. Oh, it? that doesn't sound fun. So I, like, felt sick and came in here to, like, sleep. I totally feel like I've wasted my time because I, like, slept a long time. So she just walked in here and no one noticed? Yeah. I mean, I did. <laughs> I okay, did when well, I yeah. came in and I was like, yeah, I'll just leave her. So you were sleeping here the entire time. Yeah, ever since lunch. So, you don't know anything about the murder that took place. Like, what? Oh, that! I, like, totally know nothing. I don't believe you. <laughs> Wait, so what time is it now? Exactly. In the In lunch, game? Lunch. Or yeah. real life? So, no, she's just like, lunchtime. I'm like, wait, so what time is it now? Like, 12.01? I don't think we can check. Phoenix, uh, check your attorney watch. Check your, check your phone, Phoenix. All right. <laughs> it didn't do anything. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta check your attorney watch, put on your attorney shoes, activate your attorney jumpsuit. You know how before we were saying, like, uh, wouldn't it be funny if people had, like, special moves where they would just shout out a thing and then add a thing to it? Fucking, yeah. what do you think, uh, what do you think Phoenix's would be? Objection. You, just yell objection, yeah. <laughs> well, no, 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 because we were, because it was like, it was like thunderclap fist, or like dark, or, or dark slash, or whatever, and stuff like that. Blood slash. Blood slash. Blood slash. <laughs> no, it's blood not. Slash. It's not. Excuse you, Saba. It's not blood slash. It's blood slash. Oh my gosh, I can't do that. You guys are just <laughs> too <slash>. good. <laughs> Phoenix's is uh. Phoenix rising. <laughs> no. Edward kiss. Edward. Edward. And then Edward says, "My tea." My tea. <laughs> uh, I was. I was just gonna mention earlier when we were talking about fucking uh Phoenix's Phoenix's attorney badge watch. I was. I was just thinking about like. Man, imagine, like, if Phoenix had, like, the fucking 80s, like, uh, fucking merchandise, and they had, like, the Phoenix right th with the special attorney copter. Oh. It's in the shape of his head. <laughs> also, Adrian gave me a good idea. His thing could just be, witness my badge. Witness my oh. badge. <laughs> what do you think of my badge? What do you, have yeah. you seen? <laughs> my badge. <laughs> have you seen this autopsy report? Oh, 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 oh. Have you seen my fist? <laughs> it punches them. <laughs> Man, that's really good. I really like that. Uh, okay. So, who was like, you know, killed? The surgeon that requested the channeling, Dr. Gray. Oh, oh she just, just says nothing. nothing. Mm. You 
and Dr. Gray knew each other, right? Oh! Oh. You're... What's wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know any <sighs> Dr. Gray! Oh, really? Then what was all that talk about him earlier? Huh? Uh, well, uh, like, a long, long time ago, I was like a patient. Yeah. I was yeah. going to die. <laughs> I was like a patient, and then Dr. Gray suggested that I get whatever a lobotomy is. Oh, no. <laughs> I was literally about to make no, that. No, she, she just says lob lobotai. Lobotai. Lo lo she can't even say it. She, he scraped my brain. He's... He got he got this ice pick. That's why my <laughs> eyes are closed, right? Because because there's nothing, went in, there's through nothing my in eye. No, no, no. He's, she's like she's like. So he got this. Like, he opened my skull up, and I was he didn't get any like NS NS juice, and so I watched him like use his big spoon and treat my head like a cereal bowl. Oh, no. oh my goodness! Because the brain has no nerve endings. <laughs> Um, she sounds like she's trying to hide something. Man, if only I had some sort of mechanic that would force her to talk to me. My pet! Have, have you Your seen bad. my pet? Have you seen my pet? Like, I'm really sorry, but I'm not all that smart. So I don't, like, get it? Hmm. Do people I actually feel like say she's that? Just putting on an act. Oh, How about oh, this one, dude? Yeah, Hello, I forgot like Carrie I don't... was here. <laughs> Sorry. Dude, I say Thanks. that I'm... Dude, I, I say that I'm stupid, like, all the time to, as an excuse not to have to process something. Wait, is this it? This is all I have to do with her? Apparently. I have what's called Well, no but that's in the brain. context of, like, I mean, we're all smart, right? But has, like, someone Stick incredibly... Stick for yourself. Stick for yourself. <laughs> okay, well, I can't say anything about any of you I'm guys. I'm not smart, I'm, I'm a streamer. <laughs> streamer sucks, zero oh, IQ it. streamer. I have what they call dumb bitch disease. <laughs> I have what they call dumbass. Anyway, you <laughs> left the blank in a mess. Aren't you gonna fold it? Like you're of heart and dumb of ass. Like I had, <laughs> like I had a really good nap, and like I was thinking of leaving it like this, so like it's all set for tonight. <laughs> to come dumb of ass to memories. <laughs> <laughs> to commemorate the memories and also so that way the artists don't have to make a new art asset. Dumb of ass and thick of ass. Yes. Ooh. Dumb of ass and thick of thighs. Oh! Yeah. Oh! This... Oh, There's is this gonna be pearly? Dude, I love her. There's no one here as usual. Oh! Oh, God. <laughs> oh God, she's so tiny. She barely fits over the fucking, uh... Text the box. Text well, box. then that fits me perfect, because I'm short in real life, too. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. You, you talk to Saba, and half of her face is covered by the text box. <laughs> Don't remind oh, no. me of that, okay? You, you talk to Grant. I have a complex. You talk to Grant, and like you can't see anything from his nose <laughs> up because it's off the screen. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, that's so funny. I'm sorry. We're or, freaks. Uh, wait. Uh, well, I mean, wait, the I difference have, between. Wait, I have a question. Real, real quick, and then and then Adrian can speak. So. We already established that mystics, when they channel someone, like, oh, physically no. turn into them. Yeah. What the fuck happens to Pearly? I, I guess. She, like, grows three feet, like, taller. That's what I, that's kind of what I think. She's, like, a miniature version of an adult? So, so, that, so that's the thing, right? Is, does she turn into them, but as, like, a small child? Or does she turn into an adult? Well, if, if it, it happens, I guess we'll see. I guess. I mean, she probably can. She's like, what, nine? Yeah, Does she have it, that but power? Then, but isn't she, uh, well, that's true. But isn't she, like, well, incredibly Maya said she talented was, or whatever? Yeah, Maya said she was good at channeling. Oh, you're right. Yeah, because we'll they, they, do, they do practice channelings. So, yeah. Um, ah, uh, hey, how are you? You're Pearl, right? Is is this why you wanted this character? Because she doesn't talk. <laughs> oh no! It, it gets it gets. I I love her. You'll see. I was I was gonna say something, but I realized it was really mean to Saba. <laughs> oh. 
Adrian, so you do hate me. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was, listen, it, it was the same tear of thought that you get when you see sand and want to stick a handful of it and shove it into your mouth. It was an intrusive thought. It was an intrusive <laughs> thought. It's the, call, well, just ate it's the call of the void. How she got there in her hand? Sometimes, Sometimes you hear the devil on your shoulder unprompted speak to you. Well, I guess I'm glad you restrained yourself. Hey, I, Pearly, I need you to seen... be thankful for that. Hey, Pearly, have you seen my bed? Dole! Oh my god. She's alive! <laughs> Wait. And she's she gone. It. What is it? Is it my hair? Is it too spiky? Not spiky enough? <laughs> That's how I you... constantly gauge you, my you hair. Go... You go to the next court scene of Phoenix's hair is spiked both forwards, backwards, and upwards. <laughs> he just looks like a fucking uh, like Yu-Gi-Oh character. All right, well. Hope Wait, so I do have to say real fast. You, so she does come back. Right. Wait to the Winding Way. Yeah. Oh. Oh. oh okay. I think she like hides in a corner or something. So you can talk to her more, I guess. <laughs> She's just gonna run away. Oh yeah, it's just every single time if you do something wrong. I guess you have bedhead today. Phoenix. No, no. He has bedhead every day. Oh, shit, I didn't want oh. to walk here. Howdy. He's looking at you all day. Man, I'm just thinking about how uh, in Ace Attorney, I think six, there's a brief cutscene. I'm not gonna spoil anything, but like, there's a cutscene where Phoenix has to go travel somewhere by plane. And like they do not a full animation, but like a like a slideshow of him like going from his house to like the airplane, and like it's it's presented this like very fast paced like urgent like quick thing with the music and the pacing, but like if you go through the slideshow, it's like he gets in the taxi and forgets his suitcase and has to walk back to get his suitcase and then walk to the airport and then <laughs> mid walk in the airport his suitcase just flies open and has to gather all the stuff. His suitcase is like messily gathered. He oh, rushes no. to the gate and barely makes it on time. The poor man. And it's wow. like, man, Phoenix is a fucking klutz. <laughs> um. Okay, I don't think you have anything right now that she'll be. Oh, interested. okay. So this is so this is if I interact with her. Period. She runs away. Yeah, I don't think you've unlocked the, the way to get her to not run away. You're not what powerful if, enough to talk with if, her yet. What if I challenge her to combat and then... Oh, wait, wait, wait. You'll lose. No, 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 Hold up, hold up. G give me a quick second. What if I challenge her to a Shaolin showdown, my attorney's badge for her key? You'll lose. Shit. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't me who said that, okay? Does your badge but have what... literally any occult power? I didn't think so. No, it might not, but what about my two-ton tunic? <laughs> Do you mean the one that you left at home? Oh. What <laughs> about my golden tiger claw? The one you left at home? <laughs> Fuck. Uh, wait, wait a second, let me check my bag. Um, 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 um. Phoenix, uh, you, you... Oni Orb! You left that you, you you left that in the in the train on the way here and it left without us. Oh god. Alright. What if I what about rock, paper, scissors? Yeah, right, yeah, yeah, maybe, maybe. <laughs> she reads my mind <laughs> and beats me every time. She just right. snaps all your she, fingers. She's the opposite of Maggie Bird. She wins every single game of rock, paper, scissors. Oh, oh god. Alright, Carrie, you have oh. to reprise your oh, role. Oh god, she's back? Yeah, right? she's back. Oh yeah. Did you not watch the other stream? I have not had the chance to. I am employed. Traitor. Yeah, if you haven't realized, we're currently in a village, right? Which is surrounded by a lot of trees, so... And cl clones of Lada. Yeah. No! <laughs> too, there are too many clones! You are done like... with clones! We got... No, I no. Like... No, absolutely not, because we have we have Kermits that meodically reproduce. We got gumshoes that are being cloned and spliced together willy-nilly. No more clones. But I like clones. I don't care. <laughs> I am I am fucking Count Dooku. No more clones. What? I don't think no jutsu. No more clones. <laughs> Alright, fine. We only have droids now. <laughs> no droids. And droids can be easily replicated, but no more clones. <laughs> She's probably scared out of her wits after having a murder take place right in front of her. Lada? Gosh, Arnold, let me be ah. next! Oh. Kakabushi no Jutsu! 
Well, you need to is it Carrie or Adrian that's doing this? Oh, sorry. Oh, okay. I will say Carrie yeah, so Carrie, she can it. take some lines. Let yeah. me get back into care. Oh. Eek! Don't scare me like that. What do you mean? You're the one scaring me. Wait, Adrian, who do you have any speaking roles now? Well, uh, okay. What well, we yeah, were thinking before, crazy. Zach, is uh, I don't even remember Eni, right? When Carrie wasn't here, you would take over Eni, but I was thinking maybe because Adrian doesn't have any other speaking lines and he was Lada before. Then he can take Phoenix. Okay, yeah, if that's mean, what you want to do. I want to do silly voices! <laughs> Yeah, I was going to say there is one character, but, like, he is in this case for a very short amount of time. How about this, Adrian? I'm mm -hmm. going to cut back on my clever quips, and I want you to be the ghost of Dr. Grey. <laughs> <laughs> Just shifting between... Because his, his voice is like, like, 20s newsman that crosses the goblin sometimes. And then comes right back as soon as the animation yeah. stops. You could also be the weather woman that's just constantly talking in the background. <laughs> <laughs> Phoenix, it's me, the weather woman. I'm here to report to you and, but weather. But always Why? wrong. Like, you should say she's going to hail tomorrow. <laughs> no, no, dude. It's, it's, like, it's like Phoenix is like, hey, what's this thing my badge? And Zob's like, this is, the, this is the automatic attorney weather app that you cannot close now. <laughs> you opened it. This is basically weather it. bug. It's with you forever now. You'll have anyway, to format your hard drive. <laughs> I guess I can take uh, Eni later, or if you come back to her. Oh, okay. Unless, unless you want me to do Phoenix. I can do Phoenix, too. You don't have another dead body in your hands. Fine. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, okay. Sorry. Yeah, Zach, do you want me to do Phoenix or Eni? I want to do both. <laughs> All right, then I guess I just won't speak. Well, no, no, no. Here, here. How no, about no, this? Give a, Whenever no, Eni's a... talking, uh, Zach, Phoenix can be taken by Adrian. I don't see a problem with that, but then uh, Grant does have two voices. Sure. I, I will not let Grant not be that aunt. <laughs> Listen, I always make a slurp my kidding. slurping character. Grant has to widen his horizons. That's true. I have right. to be all the good. older women. And, and obviously, no one other than Grant can be Gumshoe. <laughs> yeah. Man, I know it's really selfish, but I want to do silly voices. <laughs> Who is. Uh, wait, Saba, who's going to be the really important character we're going to see later on shortly? I don't remember who we're talking about. Dang, just just text, just send a text it to me, Adrian. Sure, I'll I'll Discord PM you. It's like, I'm I'm trying real hard. Carry it to you. Talk. Ah, well, maybe one thing. Are you sure that you didn't see more than just one thing, Lada? Because with your eyes being so far apart, you basically have a 360 degree view around you. Listen, man, I see at least one thing at all times. <laughs> at least. Lotta is like, listen, my eyes are forward facing because I am an apex predator. Are and you, I see my prey are, right are in human, front of me. Are human eyes forward facing? Yeah, we're apex yeah. predators. Oh, wait, really? Yeah. Well, we're. That's, I mean, that's okay, the whole so. Thing. I mean, front facing eyes are more generally a thing that for predators, not just apex predators, and humans are persistent hunters. So, so I guess that makes sense. Also, it has to do with like quadrupeds versus bipeds, which I don't want to go into right now, but like, it's a thing. Oh, wow, yes. Carrie, I, I think, you're Carrie, a based off of that, you are so, like, you have so in depth knowledge that I don't even think I want to start <laughs> questioning you. <laughs> we can't question her. She's a scientist. Oh, shit. Turns out my poor stomach's not good at handling this kind of thing. Zach's stomach is not good at <laughs> Expired milk. I used to be able to handle expired milk, and I guess I can't no more. Yeah, that's just yogurt. Ew. Uh, what? Curses and ghosts and stuff coming back to get you. This is just too much, I say. What's too much? Being an occult, an occult photographer. You need to stop changing That's your some scary shit, so I'm gonna try to be a celebrity photographer now. Alright, I'm sure we'll see you in a later case. <laughs> Going after photos more within your reach from now on. More glamour, less gore? I don't know, there's still gonna be the same amount of gore. 
What? Yeah, she's gonna be she's gonna be a phot uh, photographer for Quentin Tarantino. What's up? Oh yeah. What oh. is it? Is Tarantino the some guy? Hot pictures earlier. Sorry, uh, Adrian. I was just asking if Tarantino is the feet guy. Yes. Quentin yeah, Tarantino's he's the feet guy. guy. Also, Quentin if you Tarantino. haven't watched the stream, Lada telling Phoenix that is very disconcerting. What? I took some. Hot I took some, I took some out of contact. Skinny That's amazing. <laughs> I took some hot pictures. <laughs> huh? Remember, I took some pictures of the murder scene inside. Ah, she did too, even. The seance murder. I sure like the ring of that. It'll be a sensational story. Lotta the seance murder. The seance. <laughs> The oh my god, murder. that would be an amazing, like, joke character in a game where everybody's undead. It's like, it's like a ghost singer with a giant butt and her name is Seance. That'd be great. Lotta! Sorry, but my journalistic sense is burning inside me. You're hardly a journalist. Hate to cut and run, but I'm heading back in. Gotta beat those cops to the scoop of the century. <laughs> Wow, she's crazy. So she leveled she she leveled up in her witch skills. <laughs> she ate some kermits on the way out here and the way in. She ate, she ate a few witches. She ate a few spirit mediums. Oh no. Oh, dude, witches witches found enough. in the woods. I oh, guess. No. She, excuse you, Adrian. She can't eat any spirit mediums because they're not vegan. They were kermit spirit mediums. <laughs> you can't say that. Good for mediums. <laughs> it's too much. Why does it feel like we've been put We've been through this before. I, I almost said put through this as like a second nature. I want to look um, at that mountain. Can you go anywhere else? Uh, I can go back inside, I think. Yeah, that's about it. No, oh, I guess. Okay. Oh, All right. Go. Hello, Goomba. Oh, my dear madam, you have such impeccable timing. Oh, yeah. Carrie hasn't heard this before. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> this is a thing. Zach, it's all you. I insisted upon it. Like, what's all the buzz? <clears throat> Alright, everyone. Listen up. You too, pal. Me too? Uh, yeah, you too. Stop Perfect. catching fire. <laughs> but it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Stop dying. Life has more meaning when I look at the flames. Well, that, that, <laughs> yeah, that's what I was just about to say. Gumshoe's like, you get over here. And you... Don't touch that candle! And he's still just staring into the fire, just being like, but life has no meaning outside of the candle. <laughs> Stay away from me. Right, I'm, I'm just like, we're gonna have to retire on that model. <laughs> A brief update. Right now, it looks like the investigation's not going to be done until real life. That is a terrible shame. I propose that everyone sleep under the roof of the Fay Manor tonight. It's so fucking disruptive. <laughs> <laughs> the slurping. Oh, yeah. What a mess. I can't believe how crazy this day turned out. Maya was arrested and taken away by the police. Again? Again? Yeah. <laughs> and, oh, yeah. yeah I, I, she, I murdered people. She, uh, she channeled, get a hobby. She can't, <laughs> get a, her hobby is murder, clearly. Um, fucking, she channeled somebody's spirit, and then they murdered uh, the doctor from the first episode. Oh, whoopsies. And I don't see Sometimes it happens. And now I'm dead, here in the spirit channeling room. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, I'm fine. You can come get me. You open the door, he's, he's like not there, and he's like, Ah, dude, you, you, op you open the door, and it's Lancelot. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <sighs> Wait, oh, ugh, sorry. I was like, wait a minute, why would you say yawn twice? Morning. <laughs> Morning. Uh, I guess I must have nodded off at some point. I hope Maya's okay. I should hurry and get to the detention center ASAP. That takes two hours. <laughs> Minimum. Wait, going based off what we did before, is it just a sap? Huh? Like we did slime, is it just a sap? Instead of ASAP, it's a sap. Or like, oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, I think I think it's the uh, I think it's the the case numbers that we do that for. Okay, we have a block and bub block. 
That uh, was because yeah. we're dumb. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was a great bit. I love it. It was a fantastic bit. <laughs> Nick, Nick. I murdered someone again. I know. Two for two. I'm very proud of you, Maya. I'm getting too used to this place, Zach. It's starting to feel like home. Zach? <laughs> yes, I know. Who I, the fuck yeah. is Zach? I, I'm your I'm boss, talking to my, Phoenix I'm talking Wright, to my who you call friend, Nick okay? for some fucking reason. Oh, oh, you're here, Nick, too? I was talking to my spirit friend. His name was Look, Zach. Yeah, he's right there in the, he's right there in the bottom left corner. He's, you can't see him, but he's like a little short, stumpy dwarf person. <laughs> hey, I take <laughs> umbrage to this. <laughs> Okay, what am I going to do? I don't know. Get I never therapy. imagined it would turn out like this. Calm down, Maya. Take deep breaths. It was I'm only starting a to kiss. enjoy it the was only a kiss. Thank you, Adrian. Oh. <laughs> now I'm falling asleep. This is not, mis this is not Mr. Brightside. <laughs> While she's having a smoke. Come to think of it, the first time I met her, it all started right here in this detention center. It's literally the first memories we have of each other meeting at a detention center. No, the first memory was, was her hunched over a dead sister's body. That's true, oh. by the way. And Even then better. she went to jail. And then the Man, jail, yeah. first impressions. Went great. Good times. Good times. I know, I can't believe that the first time I met you, you murdered your sister, my boss, and then I still hired you. <laughs> I finally... <laughs> I finally get to see you again, Anne. It's not your fault. Do it. This is a cutscene from earlier. No, I I did it. I killed that person. Oh, it is, but like all right, game over. Gameplay. <laughs> I yeah. did it. I killed no that person, and I'm just like, and I'm just like, sure, bye. Judge <laughs> kicks in the door. Go <laughs> <laughs> But that wasn't you. Oh, which uh, I I know I mentioned this earlier, and because Adrian seems uh, like more or less familiar with the investigations games, can you fucking believe in investigations too that by law, any room that Judge Courtney is in is legally a courtroom. <laughs> that's his name. <laughs> his name? No, that's a different judge. No, no, it's it's oh, the, different it's judge. The, it, uh, 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 Grant, uh, I talked about her before. She's the like she looks like a priestess. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. So that so that's Judge Courtney, and they make it fucking canon. Uh, Courtney. <laughs> yeah. No, sorry. Uh, her name is <laughs> Just Justine Courtney. Ah, wow. gamer. Mm. Gamer. What a gamer name. It doesn't matter. I might as well have been me. I might as well have been me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was too weak, and I, I couldn't control the spirit's power, so... I don't want to bring up the case quite yet, but... You don't have to be nice to me. I understand. It's never stopped me before. Ooh, what's this music? I'm depressed. She's tired. <laughs> Have you seen my badge? Sorry, Nick, but there's nothing really special about it. What's a bitch ass badge? <laughs> Phoenix is like, fine, and he like walks out the room <laughs> crying. <laughs> I'm not, I'm, you're not special. He runs out of the room like holding in his tears. Oh my god, I'm not gonna do it because it would obviously just waste time. But I love the idea that I could just go to Kurain Village right now and then go back and then go and then back and then go and then back and then just literally <laughs> you, waste fucking 24 hours. Dude, exactly. you, you do that and then the game is like, the, like Gumshaw is like, hey, Phoenix, you missed Core, so that was, you know, an automatic guilty sentence. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, He's Grant. going to jail now. We're hurting people. Grant, you can't. <laughs> no, it makes me feel bad every time. Yeah. <laughs> oh god Grant would you mind telling that story just cause it's a good one um so Zach and I were playing through Persona 5 and uh finished. I didn't finish uh and there's one part basically like you go after corrupt people and then after you like defeat them blah blah, blah whatever they have a change of heart and they're like oh my god I, I recognize all the bad shit I did I turned myself in and so there was one where uh, you basically take down a crime boss and uh -huh. we were making the narrative of like, he, he's like in the middle of just like a party or whatever. And then he's just like, wait a minute, we're hurting people. And he uh -huh. just like runs out the room crying. And, there, and there's something about it too, because like the character is like this big fat guy. 
like he looks like he looks like your stereotypical. His personification is literally a pig. Yes. This is true. It's literally literally a piggy bank. Actually, I think his personification is a mosquito because he's a blood it's a fly. or a fly. But it's just like I don't know, man. It just makes me feel so sad just thinking of that character in this fucking one line of just like we're hurting people, and I'm like, oh. <laughs> oh, my, em yeah, my empathy. But... <laughs> uh, my kokoro, it's been heat. <laughs> what the God. fuck did you just say? My kokoro, it's doki. <laughs> it's doki doki. <laughs> All right, moving it's on. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. So you're the master of something of Karayan Village School of Channeling. Actually, my mother is for now. Isn't but she since dead? that title. We do. We have to bring that up! <laughs> but since the title is Pastor Mother the Daughter, I guess I will be someday. <laughs> but many people think that channeling isn't real, that it's all just an act. What?! <laughs> <laughs> this, it, wasn't right. this literally you, Zach? Smoking no, wires. Correct! <laughs> However. <laughs> She literally physically transforms. Smoke and mirrors. Wow. In what Mia's the courthouse? actually alive. We, yeah. we might just be covering all our bases, okay? Let's give ourselves a break. It's probably because you of her. Believe, yeah, thank you. So you believe in us, don't you? Oh, sorry, I gave myself a fucking headache because I was so upset. <laughs> How? How do they have a narrative like this? How do they let themselves do this? Yeah, because I've seen it with my own eyes. When Miles channeling his spirit... When Miles? Voice, M Miles. <laughs> Miles Edgeworth. <laughs> when he channels his spirit, his entire physical appearance changes. It's a supernatural phenomenon that occurs every time. Miles like, okay, I'm not Miles. <laughs> I have to like leave for a sec, but I'll try to come back as fast as I can. Sure. Okay. Who who's taking Maya, Adrian? I'll take possessed Maya. Well, I mean, I don't think she's gonna talk. But yeah, I was just gonna say. <laughs> Doctor Gray said that he wanted to call the nurse. So. Yes, Adrian. I was just gonna say in your joke earlier, where Maya's just staring at Phoenix, like, I'm not Miles Phoenix. Can you stop thinking about his him and his red ass for like three seconds? <laughs> red ass? Like red ass clothes. Yeah. Oh, right, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot that Big his... cheeks, tailored, the custom suit, Phoenix. I, I know you're third. I forgot that his about primary red. color scheme was red. That's my bad. You How'd that? you forget that? That's his whole thing. Because <laughs> I haven't seen him in a few seconds. His name is Miles Regworth. Regworth. <laughs> his name is Red. Red. Maya's body must have taken on the nurse's physical appearance. Red the white. What exactly happened in the channeling chamber? Ooh. That's I guess cool. I'll that's just a, that's a cool way to pray. I'll just I went to that room with, with Maya, locked the door. What? This is Dr. Gray speaking. <laughs> <laughs> and sat on a crossbar. Okay. We closed our eyes and she began the channeling. <laughs> <laughs> She's channeling Dr. Gray right now. This is sounding kind of creepy. It's like the beginning of a scary story. Oh, Grant, we never did finish that anime. What? Scary stories? Uh, what? The one that Terrence was showing us that had like ghost the stories. fucking um, ghost stories. Sorry. Yeah. That is a good anime. That's the last thing I remember. What? Oh well, yeah, no kidding. After a spirit comes in her body, she loses consciousness. Her, her she loses herself. <laughs> then you mm. don't remember a single thing. When she came to, she was being held in her aunt's arms. So. No, because we've seen her physically transform into uh, into Mia. Because like I'm thinking about it, and I'm just like, man, how fucked up? Because they, because when I was investigating the room, 
they specifically mentioned how like wow it's crazy dark behind that like ancient screen so i was like in that picture of the car accident the nurse seemed to have lived and so like could you imagine how fucking nuts so it would be if she was just hiding behind that screen and then they drugged maya to knock her out puts on maya's like outfit and then shoots him to blame maya <laughs> And Probably. then, like, does, like, another swap. <laughs> and there was blood all over her clones. Mm. Oh, but she does remember having a dream. A dream? What kind of dream did you have while you were channeling? Uh, I can't access it very well from this body, but, uh, she was dead and buried in the ground. Oh my god. She couldn't move and it was unbearable. Really suffocating. Almost as suffocating as me dying, Phoenix. <laughs> Shit sucks. I want, I want it's something like that. It's really inconvenient. <laughs> you know, as a, man of, as a man of science, I didn't think the afterlife was real, but uh, it's real and it's torturous, Phoenix. Uh, you ever had all your sins washed down your back? <laughs> what? <laughs> That's a nightmare. <laughs> I see idea what to say to that. There was a really familiar smell, too. Under the ground? Yeah. She can't quite place it, but she knows she smelled that same scent before. Dead body. <laughs> <laughs> I guess this is about all the information I'm gonna gather for today. I'll be back later, Maya. In the meantime, please make sure you prepare it, okay? What? Uh-huh. Prepare what? You'll find out if you press A. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Yeah, yeah. Please have like 5% more patience with this game. What, what is it? Who the fuck not... talks like this, Adrian? Hey, Adrian, make sure you prepare it for tonight. What are you talking what? about, Zach? <laughs> That's not how people talk! <laughs> hey, Grant. What? Make sure you prepare it. Yeah, sure. Okay. <laughs> Then that happens. Very coordinated. The document requesting me to be your attorney, of course. Why say it like this? Why not say, hey, make sure you request or, me as your attorney? Or <laughs> dramatic know. effect, Zach. Adrian. <laughs> but... Don't you like to be dramatic? <laughs> What's wrong? Oh, also, Saba, I don't know if you could hear, but Adrian was not. He was reading Maya's lines, technically, but uh, he was Dr. Gray being channeled by Maya reading her lines. <laughs> oh, I love that. I was going to actually ask who reads Maya when I'm gone, so that's great. Yeah, that's why I think it was really good. Are you sure? I mean, I'm guilty. I'm a murderer. Oh, I, don't stop chatting me. Uh... I also really want to admit, by the way, uh, that I cannot hear these characters' voices in anything other than your guys' voice. <laughs> <laughs> like oh. Phoenix, Phoenix sounds like nothing to me when I read his lines in my head because I'm speaking. But Gumshoe sounds like Grant doing the fucking, fucking what's his name? Patrick, Patrick Warburton. Warburton. Pat I was gonna say Will Warburton, and I was like, I don't think that's right. Close. <laughs> but sounds like him, and then Maya just sounds like Saba talking a little bit higher pitched. Ugh. Edgeworth sounds oh. like Saba talking with a bad accent. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't yeah. have a consistent enough role for Zach to remember anything specific for me. You and Carrie are constantly just freaking switching up. We need to give you more consistent character. Well, actually, that's I not true. Say, that's not true. Uh, I read Larry They're as... They're a jack of all trades. I read, I read Larry as uh, Carrie's fucking... Um, all right, well, I, I, yeah. I, I would like to take a consistent role, and I have an idea of what it's going to be soon. I, I can agree with him. Chief as Adrian. You can only no, it'll be, it'll be even better. The chief of police. Yeah, remember from the Damon last Gant? Case, Oh, Damon, Damon Gant. Gant. Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> remember, oh, I'm not Damon evil. Gant come remember, back? I'm not evil. He does um, not come back. <laughs> I, I would, oh, do I would you want to get in my back. swimming pool? I'm not evil. <laughs> <laughs> that was the thing too. Was that his character design was all like electric for whatever reason? He was very orange, and then he just kept wanting people to get into bodies of water. <laughs> That's such a weird I'm not evil. thing. He's not evil. He's not evil. Decided that yet? But I did. I killed that person with these 
two hands. That's enough, Maya. It's hopeless. If you defend me, you'll lose, I'm sure. <sighs> like, I know it's for... Stop it! <laughs> 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 wow, this started off so calm. <laughs> Snapped into it. Because as soon as I saw it, I was like, ah, finally, my emotions. <laughs> it's like... They can all come out. It's so, like, like... I, like, I know that they can't do this, and I know this is only game two, but I really wish the characters would tap into the idea that Phoenix is a god. Just let him go, you know? <laughs> like, clearly you didn't do this, Maya. <laughs> help me. <laughs> oh, that's so sad. Nick, help me. I'm scared. <laughs> Please stop saying it like that. You're making me think I'm going to turn around. This is going to be like a little doll. With a knife. <laughs> yeah, that's what she's staring at. She's staring at over your head, Phoenix, not at you. I'm behind. being held hostage, Phoenix. I can't actually move from my spot. Don't worry, I will. When's the trial? It sounds like tomorrow. God, this fucking hellscape, oh my Jesus. <laughs> as as usual, zero prep time. Alright, I'm going now. Wait. Uh this jewel. It's Jade. The jewel. <laughs> this is called a Magatama. Is that how it's Maga. <laughs> it's it's Magatama. Okay, because I always thought this is Magnamata. I don't never actually pronounce this properly. It's Say my it again, favorite Andrew. number, Phoenix Nine. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it's a it's Say, a, so a, say it's, it again one more time, Adrian. It's a Magatama. Okay. Yeah. It's okay. a Make America Great Again. Tomorrow, America Make Again. Okay. Nick, are you some sort of Magatama. It's a magical charm and it's always protected me. You could always just call it a nine. Give this to Pearly. And I'm sure she'll lend you her spiritual powers. If you she'll make it, it into a ten. Instead of six. Oh! <laughs> wow. Okay, so since I've always just known this as a Magnamata, can I oh, just say that? Yeah, whatever. Sure. Okay. <laughs> There's no end. Wait, I you just know what? Wait, I just thought of, wait, I just thought of something. Uh, one second. I, I got I got to look up a picture. Of both of them and then they become yin yang together. Well, yeah, but also something else. Uh a maga hat. What? <laughs> yeah, ma a maga hat. No, I was just thinking about this, right? So that so that's so that's a <laughs> uh, so that's just like the yin yang symbol, right? Is that yeah. is that not just sixty nine? <laughs> uh, I mean, maybe. I've never thought of it that way before. But Don't it's like the true. worst six I... and the worst nine ever. <laughs> that is true. All, true. All right. Excuse you. Grant. What? I said, listen, don't ruin centuries of Asian culture with this. <laughs> oh, I thought, I thought you said something else. Uh oh. Yeah. Perfectly managed. Whew, feels like I've been gone forever. Minimum 24 hours. <laughs> but it's only been one. Zach. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Where's the newspaper Dr. Gray brought the other day? Ah, here it is, right on top of my desk. This is the only thing that he left behind that's going to be of any help. What? Besides, besides his corpse. Oh, right, because it's the article. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, can I read this? No. <laughs> cool. Did you know that the plant in the office is named Charlie? Why? Oh. Because Mia named it that. Oh. Why? I think I remember that. Actually, because she wanted to name her fucking plant. Why, Charlie? She was she that, that was she that lonely in this room? <laughs> Maybe. Do you not name your house plants? Wait, what do you mean? She was. Plants. She's never in this room. She's usually always out just eating burgers. No, that's Maya. That's Maya. Oh, Mi true. Mia okay, took okay. care of herself clearly. <laughs> oh, she I mean, she also died, so like she didn't. Dude, some. Uh, dude, that wasn't her fault. Many... Listen, self care takes many mm -hmm. forms. Sometimes it's calling your plants, Charlie. Real shit. Sometimes it's getting hit Maya. upside the head with the thinker clock and dying immediately. <laughs> Don't call it a thinker clock. <laughs> Even though that's exactly what it is, it just rubs me the wrong way. <laughs> what? What's wrong with the thinker clock? 
Uh, all right, you don't want a big finger claw swung in your head? Uh, <laughs> did, did Capcom... Wait, this is made by Capcom, right? Yeah, because it, yep. it, it was in Marvel vs. Capcom. Um, did they ever make a novelty thinker clock? Probably, but I was going to just ask, Zach, if you had any problems with a big, hard, heavy thinker clock. <laughs> Especially one swinging around your head. <laughs> in principle, no. <laughs> However, in this context, it does feel threatening. <laughs> It's her life on the line. What in the world happened in that room yesterday? Man, if only we had a we, camera. Also, we've made so little fucking progress this episode. We have had so long of tangents and like in between yeah. these conversations. We, we've had we've had long tangents, and I also had to take a little bit of a respite. That's true too. Is it respite or respite? I don't know. Uh, I say respite. God, we can't go off to another tangent. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Thank you, Terry. <laughs> the meditation nurtures all mediums, young and old. Even mediums in training, I'd wager. But it's pretty deserted today. Probably because of the murder yesterday. It's right. a small and large joke. Yeah. <laughs> it looks yeah. up, it is respite. So I funny. Don't know, I don't know if it's spite, because it's despite, but it's respite. Looks like Detective Gumshoe isn't here today. I should take this chance to thoroughly check out this room. If I'm lucky, I might unclover. Unclover? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Why did it scare you so bad? <laughs> wow, she appears in the night. It's the Goomba. <laughs> It scared, what, what, what the scared fuck? me a lot. It was the it was the it was the screen automatically shifting to the side. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking... I control your camera now. I was just thinking of the idea of Phoenix standing there and then like a little like half like, half shin eye curl being like, not so fast, dick fingers. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Good morning. I am on my way to go meet Mystic Maya. <laughs> And I thought to bring her some items to make her feel more at home. Namely, tea so bitter you lose your tongue and jaw dropping large sweet strawberry desserts. Are and why? You... That was a nice addition there. Is she is she trying to turn this place into a fucking amusement park? Because this is the second or third time that she's like upselled these two items specifically. With these exact words. You know what I mean? You know, it's so you know... weird. You know what I bet it is? I bet it's like that's like a that's like a cultural meme on like Japanese or Japanese grandma. Like she's she's oh. very very Japanese. Like that's those are the most like, traditional Japanese things you could say. Like, like, yeah, like you know how you have like Americans where they have like, like the grandmas, grandmas have like the fucking Werther's originals. I bet that's a Japanese thing. Oh, yeah, daifuku, the strawberry desserts. What is the what fuck I'm thinking is of. daifuku? She it's just like said a mochi. That. It's like a mochi with the strawberry in the middle of it. What is mochi? What? My no, what? God. I don't know what mochi Wait. is. Hold, hold, Zach, hold I made fucker. you eat it. You did? I'm pretty sure I did. What was we it? Remind J-Town. me. I don't know what it is. Zach, you uncultured swine. Well, I'm glad at least other people know what I'm talking about, I guess. Wait, we have to stop the stream right now. I am outraged. Zach. What? <laughs> How have Grant? Well, I well, Zach, this is easy. Zach. Just Google it, Zach. Oh, just yeah. Google it. You Google it, you Christian. <laughs> Google it, Christian. Uh, let me see if I can. I mean, it says mochi donut. What? So, so, so Dai so Fuku, if you want to know, is spelled D A I. I thought you said I needed to look up mochi. Well, no, I just said yeah, look but up a mochi. A mochi okay, donut. Literally <laughs> type in D A I F U K U. We're making negative progress. <laughs> we seriously are. We need to get back on track. Okay, anyways, Maya will be grateful. We can Thank call you. it. We can cancel Zach for this later. We have a game to play. But yeah, just look <laughs> that up, Zach, and, and you'll know. The picture's there. This on Twitter.com. Is, this looks really good. Well, there you go. That's what I was I talking about. Yeah, it slaps wicked. Oh, up. and look, this one has a strawberry in it. Yeah, that's the yes. point. Oh, Actually, Daifuku is specifically yes. referencing, I think, the strawberry one, I think. Yeah. I didn't look up Daifuku. What was it? No. D A I F U K U. Yeah, I spelled it. Daifuku Mochi. Yeah. 
I was oh, like, and it does have I a big strawberry in it. Strawberry. Yeah, it's Sometimes really interesting. It's like a layer of on around oh. the strawberry. What the fuck is on? We're Sweet. not going there. <laughs> just, just read the line. Carrie. I don't. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm just having fun because this is really neat. I don't know what this yeah, is. Jap this this is pretty sweet. Yeah, I have I've never seen uh like Daifuku specifically here, but you gotta like just adventure on Little Tokyo for like a few days, Zach. I'm sure Maya will be very Do grateful. It. That's Mystic Maya, good sir. <gasps> oh God! I just realized I'm not gonna get my gym badges before I leave. <gasps> we never went back. We never did go back. Shit. Yeah. Also, we're talking about uh, Pokemon uh, now. Yeah, I guess so. No, we, yeah, went, uh, to, we went to Japan Town. Yeah. Also, she's mad because you didn't use the proper American honorific for Maya. America. <laughs> she's one oh. scary lady. Are you saying that, like, in the normal Japanese, it would be like an actual honorific and not just Mystic? Probably. 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 Okay. Oh dear, sweet Mystic Maya. Pearl wept constantly for you last night, as did I. I know it's important for me to search the site. But I should ask her some questions, too, while I have the chance. Spill the fucking tea, babe. Spill the wax. What? Spill the wax. I get this is an altar. Sure that's what whatever it is, it feels very important. Mirror-like object, blah, blah, blah. I guess they're used to <laughs> during the channel. Right. Yes, very makes sense. Blah, blah, blah. Is it, well, we already read these. Uh, beautiful screen looks like it's quite old. There seems to be some sort of sacred text. Oh, this this is... It's a hole! There you go. Because this have been made by a bullet. That's a very low hole. That's a good point. So that means... Well, it was eight inches. That's like a sniper hiding behind That's the That's not screen. eight inches! Well, actually, maybe it is, looking at the actual Might thing in, in real life. Take the shot! <laughs> Take the shot! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I crack so myself up sometimes. Folding screen. The light of the candles can't reach back there, so it's completely dark. Hope no one's hiding back there. Don't stop Ew. saying that game. <laughs> Hi, I'm hiding back here. Suddenly, it's this turns into a horror game. The door closes. <laughs> this is where the medium sits. They're locked in here with me. So four panels on this flooring. The straw on the floor feels quite damp. Probably from the humidity in the air. No matter or what from I the do, blood. My eyes keep getting drawn to the pool of blood in the center here. Oh yeah, that too. <laughs> Feels like it. The, the straw feels quite damp. Probably the humidity from the candles or the blood. Did you just say the humidity? From we the could candles? never know. Yeah, that's what Phoenix said earlier. No, he said from the air. Well, whatever. Either way. <laughs> I don't think. I don't think. I don't think candles give off humidity. Because if they did, it'd be wax, and that would kill you. <laughs> That's the oh, plan. Shit. I keep dropping my dice today. The meditation room is on the other side of this very heavy looking door. The lock is broken because, well, I broke it. If <laughs> that's true, I did. <laughs> it didn't seem possible, but I managed to break it pretty badly. When we want to do something bad enough, people can do the most amazing things. Phoenix then suddenly realizes that his shoulder hurts and he, like, shifts it a little bit, and it's just fucking gravel. <laughs> oh, God. All right, I think we're probably Phoenix good. Has unlocked his inner attorney strength. I would like to ask you a few questions about what happened yesterday. Do you mean that awful tragedy? Duh. That man murdered me, so I killed him. Is that a Kermit? <laughs> but it's a flashback. Fine, fine. fine. Oh, it is that a flashback. Man murdered... That man murdered me, so I killed him. That is true. Why that? Th uh, because this is a flashback. Why isn't it black and white? Yeah, I don't know. they're reenacting it <laughs> right now <laughs> with Maya. Technology has suddenly become very advanced. No, oh, no. What happened here in this room after I left? Well, first I struck Mystic Maya on the head. I called it with a thinker clock. I <laughs> with a thinker clock. And then I hit her again, and again, and again, and again. Man, this- man, <laughs> She's this, dead now. This, oh my god. This, That's uh, not Maya. This game series is very liberal with the amount that it just fucking thwaps its characters. <laughs> Dude, the, it's five was rated M. Why was she supposed to go unconscious? Why would I do that? 
Anyways, yeah. Grant. <laughs> you fucked with me for a second there. <laughs> Next, I performed the spirit severing technique. Was that I hit not, her again. I was about to say, was that not hitting her? Spirit severing technique? It's the, it's the karate chop, but I yell spirit severing technique while I do it. <laughs> uh, who and are I you fucking... And uh, I missed. Fuck, what's, it, what's his name from Mob Psycho? Oh, uh... Because it's an R. Yeah. Reagan? Reagan. Ronald Reagan. <laughs> Ronald Spirit, Reagan? My Spirit God. severing Spirit technique, and he just karate chops them in the in the carotid oh. artery. Ronald McDonald? No. <laughs> the spirit of that nurse was inside of Maya's mystic Maya's body. I used the technique to send the nurse's spirit back into the other world. I wonder if this kind of testimony is even admissible in a court of law. By the I way, mean... what is this room exactly? The channeling chamber? This room was created for the sole purpose of preventing such tragedy as yesterday. The channeling Quite chamber? A... That's the chamber where we channel things. <laughs> the channeling chamber, the, the, the area in which the master continuously flips through TV channels. Yep. They which is exactly stop. what I was going the ch to The channeling that. chamber, where we've tried a very fashionable we modern get it's, it's the channeling chamber, where we put on designer purses. The channeling, the channeling chamber where uh, we get a decently large body of water in between two large land masses. This is why we haven't made any progress. <laughs> <laughs> but it's fun! <laughs> Alright, well, we're not getting to my character this game or this, this session, I don't think. I think that's fine. Seeing as we have eight minutes left. We might not get to my character within the next session either. It's okay, it's okay, Adrian, you can practice. Sometimes sure. when an inexperienced medium calls an especially strong spirit. <laughs> Carrie? No, nothing. Okay. That spirit may become violent and revolt as you witnessed today, yesterday. Revolt? But how? When a spirit enters a medium's body, she loses her will, and herself steps aside. To put it another way, the spirit is borrowing the medium's body, good sir. Isn't that extremely dangerous? Probably. That's it. <laughs> but, yeah. But Maya, I mean Mystic Maya, that was her first channeling. And that is why I insisted on locking the door. However, I never thought that would be calling danger upon the client himself. I am grateful that one of our heirlooms was not damaged in this horrible accident. And what would and that would be That folding screen right there. It is the Kudain sacred writings. And if behind it is the sword of the ancients. <laughs> yeah. Maybe this the, might not be the best time to mention that there's a hole in your Yeah, more more just like game. if if someone told me there was a hole in it, I would murder them so I could channel them forever and torture <laughs> their body on this eternal realm. If I ever found out that something had happened oh. to either one, oh, the humanity. Odd for her to be worrying about the folding screen at the time. Like it. So this is like the game, like, being like, hey, wink, wink, nudge, nudge, go look at it. Laptail screen after all. Oh. Ugh. So... How is Pearl today? Mr. Wright. <laughs> yes? In this world, Pearl is my most treasured possession. What about in other and worlds? Even then, when compared to even Mystic Maya, Pearl has the spiritual power to become a master. That's very impressive. Until now, the women of the Branch family have thought themselves to be inferior. Aren't they the only ones that can do the magic bullshit, though? But Pearl is different. I don't think so. Her spiritual strength is so great, it's even greater than some of the main family. Yes, Pearl is a channeling prodigy and is the pride of the Branch family. I'm gonna... I'm gonna punt her over the fence like a kickball, dude. Like, yo, try, little bitch. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that was per that was Pearl from outside. <laughs> wow. You think she'll let you get near her? In any case, our world is so different from yours. Perhaps it is best for you to quit, good sir. Quit? Quit what? Yes, let me get away with murder. Well then, I do believe <laughs> it's time for me to take my leave. All right. 
tell Maya I said hi. What was that? Mystic Maya. Uh, I mean, Mystic Maya. I will tell her. Wait! Dude, you know, you know what I just realized looking at a Google? Uh, like, between the main games to, like, 5 slash 6, they changed Maya's eye color from brown to blue. That's weird. What? For, oh, like, dude. no good reason. <laughs> That like n like something didn't happen in a game that caused her eyes to change. Yeah, her eyes just changed color. So, all right, real quick, if I had not gone to that third option and just showed her the screen, do you think she would have acknowledged it or would have been like, "Oh, I'm busy"? Probably. Probably. Oh, I'm busy. Okay. Or she would just yell at you to not get close to the screen. Or you would yeah. game over as she strangles you to death. With my bare hands. Little Pearl is in here today. Maybe she's at school? School. Yeah, Mystic School. Mystic hey, school. there's a box here this time. Made of rebar? No, it's it, it's like wicker. My bad. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh shit, I skipped it. Oh, hey! Like, you're that guy from yesterday. The, uh, dentist guy. No, no, I'm a lawyer. If you can't tell, I was reading the stream. <laughs> <laughs> That's right! Um, Mr. Smith Esquire. That's right. Wait, I mean, you're wrong. My name is right. Smith, right. Well, I got, like, three letters at least. Yeah, you did. Yeah. yeah, that's true. And and the fact that you were able to figure that out by just phonetically saying them kind of proves that you're not an idiot. Also, I was just going to say, wait, since Phoenix is a lord, doesn't that actually make him Esquire as his title? He's a lord? He's a lawyer. Oh, lawyer. Oh, yeah, I guess that would make him an Esquire. If he's, no fucking, one... if he's fucking pompous. <laughs> I'm surprised that Edward doesn't demand people call him as, like, Edward Esquire. I totally believe that. I don't think she gets the point. Anyway, why are you he Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, okay. why are you here? So, like, I study this thing called parapsychology. <laughs> so, I, like, study this thing called parasaurolophus, and at this Par college, and... <laughs> Parapsychology? Parapsychology? Parapsychology. You told me about that yesterday. The sesame allergy, too. What I'd really like to know is why you're still here today. She does this, like, little wiggle sometimes in between the animation. It's a little weird. She shimmies. She shimmy shimmy. She's giving you the shimmy shoulder. Oh! Oh my god, there's so many commas in her dialogue. Oh, so, like... That's what you meant. <laughs> like, you should have been, like, more clear about it. S sorry. My bad. No, it's okay. Like, it's really... Uh, that's it? Why'd you stop mid-sentence? <laughs> did I? So, like, what was I talking about again? <laughs> Zach, you say that that's a lot of commas, but having grown up here, I've met people that have that many commas like that this. true. I mean, yeah. in writing. <laughs> oh if no! Lana don't ask me about that. Genuine mysterious phenomenon. It's right here. Commas are my nemesis. <laughs> you are right here. <laughs> All well, right. I'm about to say that's more or less perfect timing. I'm gonna save it. Man, made a lot of progress today. I'm really. Happy. We did not. <laughs> I was gonna say. We made just so as the last... much progress. As Guys, a last minute thing, I wanted to point out that like. I just, like, had an epiphany that, like, the reason that Zach and I butt heads is because my name starts with A and his starts with Z. <laughs> natural oh. enemies. Na so we're natural <laughs> enemies. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> All right. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, everyone.